we're going back and rehearsing the book of Revelation and the things that we learn from that and part putting them into practice into our lives. We saw that we need a fresh vision of Jesus, that we ask for him for that, that we've seen that n things are not as they seem, that there's more going on than meets our unaided senses. We saw that God is at the controls, that we're in a spiritual war, and that we need to live discerningly, that we need to live with our eyes open and with our spiritual senses on, on alert. The 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 sixth thing is that we need to live lamb like the in the book of revelation as we saw that you have uh, you have the lion used once, and, and, and it's, it's pertaining to the tribe that Jesus is coming from. The whole rest of the book, 30 times, is, is lamb, that, that we're to live lamb-like. We're following the way of the lamb. How did the lamb win? He, he won by laying down his life. He won by dying. We win by laying down our lives. We win by dying. Let that sit on you for a minute. You win. The victory of God comes in and through you, through your sacrifice, for your self-sacrifice for the sake of others, for you laying down your life, for you to renounce yourself. In fact, you find your truest self when you do lay down your life. Yes, it works that way. It's counterintuitive, but it is the way that it works. Where? Where in your life are, are, are you you know, apt to muscle it through and to self-assert and all those different kind of things. Where is it in your life where you, you're tempted to live not lamb-like, but instead to speak your mind and to, this is just who I am and I'm just a person who speaks my mind or I'm a person who retreats and doesn't ever say anything or whatever that it, that is. The challenge to us is that we live lamb-like, that we, in situations that come up, that, that demand uh, that, wow, I can serve uh, my family, I can serve these people, I can serve my neighbor, I can, I can serve, that's lamb-like, that the son, the son of Man came not into the world not to be served, but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many, and that that is his way, that you and I are laying down our lives. Who is it in your life today? Who is it in your life consistently that you need to take a different approach and say, you know what? I need to live lamb-like. I need to live sacrificially here. I need to lay down my life and become more lamb-like.